Hello Year 7 Resilience session today, but before we go into all that, it's time for the Beat the Teacher competition. Okay, I'm going to pass over to our collaborator this week, Mr. Sedgley, who's going to get five challenges. Your job is to try and beat him. Okay, here we go, first question. I reckon that is Namibia. I have no idea what the capital is, so I'm going to guess something like Namibia City. That's all I've got. Question two. Ooh, I should get this easily, as I'm a maths teacher as well. So that will be... Oh my word, come on, this is embarrassing. So that will be 128. 20%. 32, so the rest is 128. I hope that's correct. Before Mount Everest was discovered, what was the highest mountain in the world? Ah, uh, Mount Everest just wasn't discovered yet, was it? Can't get me that easily. Question four. What is wrong with the following sentence? My friends have lost their, they are, tickets to the concert. There should be T H E I R. Got it. Some months have 30 days, some months have 31 days. How many months have 28 days? Well, February doesn't always have. But so February, February sometimes has 29, isn't that what happens on a leap year? Was the other way around? It has 29, and on the leap year, only has 28. Oh, this is one of them. I'd... One then, February. I don't know. So, pretty confident I got four there. Hopefully, got that maths question correct. Let's see if all you lot at home can beat me. Good luck. Also, quick shout out to Mr. Hunter, the second coolest year seven form tutor behind me of course, thank you for getting me involved and I hope everyone in his form and the rest of Year 7 are staying safe and staying well at home, hopefully see you all soon. Is it me or did he get 3, not 4? Nice try Mr Setchley, but nevertheless 3 out of 5, not a bad, not bad, not bad at all and that does put Mr Setchley on top of the teacher's leaderboard, ahead of Mr Roberts. So we'll get another collaborator in next week, hopefully. Uh, if you have any requests for any teachers that you want uh, to, to see do the teacher challenge, then um, email them in. Um, and one final thing, um, because it's resilience, I found a really thought-provoking movie short. It's made by, made by Pixar, the same people who make the Toy Story films. Um, and it's called For the Birds. And just give it a watch. You can talk about it with someone in your household or if you just want to have a think about it to yourself. But give it a watch nevertheless and try and think what the think about what the meaning of this video is. Okay? Best of luck. Hope you have a great week here if you need.